that's the way you want it, huh? Green Ranger versus the White Ranger. Tiger Sword! Dragon Sword! Jeez, What's up, everybody? You got your boy, the k -Lox King, back at it again with another video. Big country in the building, Southern Truth. Yee! Anyway, we back at it again with another video. This is the Apex Predator Series video of the most savage moments in WWE history. I am a big wrestling fan, just like a lot. I like wrestling, anime, all types of stuff. So I'm going to be mixing up all my types of reactions and stuff because you know, I watch a lot of other different things just as much. But, you know, Apex Predator series has always been pretty him. And then there's the other one that be posting videos and stuff like this. But, you know, I always like nonsense. I have, <laughs> I have a soft spot for ignorant things to be going on. And I definitely love when they blur the line between, you know, storyline and reality. Because sometimes they cross them lines and we be like, ooh. So, not too much to get into here. Oh, my computer felt like that. There we go. Let's go. So, yeah, let's get into it, y'all. One of the greatest intercontinental champions of all time. Thank you, Sammy. I mean that. Big Daddy Rest in Cole Diesel. Rest in You won Scott the Intercontinental Hall. Championship, too. And Sean Waltman. You, uh... Oh, you no. know exactly how much the Intercontinental title weighs because he carried these guys' bags for so many years. Ooh, <laughs> Sammy. You're going to disappoint your wife, but you're probably used to that anyway. Mm. I know you do consider yourself to be the queen of hardcore. Oh my god. Movies don't quite count. Yo! <laughs> hey, Jericho used to go in on Stephanie McMahon all the time. Chris Jericho is the GOAT, especially right now. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Somebody trying to call me over here. Jesus Christ. Hold on, yo. What the? Sorry about that, y'all. They don't have to wait. Anyway. This dude, Jericho, man, was the GOAT. <laughs> and there go my boy, Booker T, the intro music right there, as you see. Um, what was I saying? Basically, yeah, Stephanie, whoo, she was definitely a punching bag for being called a hoe, slut, all type of things. That was when you was allowed to say all that stuff without no issues and stuff. But, you know, people are so sensitive nowadays. You can't say, it seems like you can't, you can't even say, the S word, S I M P, you know, when you're talking about them type of guys, they say that's offensive. That's weird to me. A lot of this stuff going on is weird, but that's a whole nother conversation or everything. Anyway, yeah, he used to stay going in on her. Then, because <laughs> I'm gonna pull that one video up one time of when he, uh, when Stephanie got arrested and then he came out. Oh my God, that is the funniest one. If you haven't seen that one, go look that up. That was when Stephanie got arrested and Jericho was singing, bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? That shit was hilarious. That's the hell up, man. So that puts me beyond hunger. Hell, I'm starving. Mm. But you don't look hungry to me. In fact, you look full, full of crap. Oh. I didn't get mad when you stole all my moves. Let me tell you something, Kurt. I know you're full of shit. Oh go come near my wife again. Oh. Jesus Christ. And I'm gonna. <laughs> if I wanted to main event the Royal Rumble with, with a megastar, megastar I would have chose your wife. What happened with Michael Jackson today is nothing compared to what I got away with when I was making out with your wife behind your back. Woo! I was winning big ones when you were down there in WCW on Monday Nitro, getting your monkey ass whooped by Juventud Guerrero. Oh. How does it feel to be married to someone who wears more makeup than you? Jesus. <laughs> that, that, boom. 
Low blow. Talking about how you own this show? Between that comment and those clothes you're wearing, what have you been smoking? And that's RVD saying that. One last opportunity to beating. Him. So they give you an effing beating. The question you shouldn't be asking is how you doing. The question you need to be asking that little baby is who's your daddy? Oh, oh. I would, but um, I know where that hand's been. Mm. The only thing bigger than your ego is that jackass right there. <laughs> Speaking of focusing on the wrong things, how is your wife? Oh. Your daddy's not here anymore. Oh. And what's so bad about that moment where the, the one with Roman Reigns just said, your daddy not here no more? That's for real. His daddy is for real dead. And Roman just, ooh, he ran with that moment. That that was, ugh, that was ugly. I didn't have to marry into my success. I earned this Hall of Fame ring. Ugh. The world that you are Brock Lesnar, the bitch. Man. There may be a lot of people in here that think that I suck, but every damn person in here knows that you do. And that's gotta be Lita. <laughs> Why do I do was, that? How was your movie, by the way? Oh, I missed I, it. Mine, mine went straight to DVD, just like yours. Oh. Because if he keeps messing up, the tribal chief is going to be his daddy. Ooh. Your daddies, your uncles, your cousins, I love them all, but you two are assholes. Why? And I'm going to tell you. Damn. My tag team division is full, but I hear that TNA is hiring. Mm. Hey, you know, and any wrestling fan knows at that moment, that was crazy Kurt Angle said that on TV. Because you know WWE be trying not to open that forbidden door like that. So, you know, to hear him say that on Monday Night Raw was crazy. So, yeah. Careful you don't hurt your neck again going through those ropes. Mm. You were in the WWE getting suspended for failing drug tests. No matter what you've been telling yourself the oh, past few me. years, size does matter. <laughs> I forgot about that. Jesus and Cass hit him with it too. That was when Cass was actually cool. I forget what his name is now, but I know he popped up at AEW or something like that now, I think. Either Impact or AEW, one of the two. But um, that was funny because, you know, that was when Seth's, uh, Seth Rollins' leaks got out. <laughs> and he hit him with that, though. That, that's crazy. Whether it was that phony power of positivity. Certainly we've got similarities. We don't smoke. We don't drink. We don't do drugs. But you know Anymore. something? Uh. Why do they have to shave their heads and you don't? It's the same reason Shawn Michaels was bald and you didn't have to shave yours. Oh. Y'all look just like your mug shots. How was it getting arrested? You're the brains of this operation. Your wife's the brawn. <laughs> Number one, since I'm the only man in the family. Damn. You know, I know the whole damn world knows that big son of a bitch never busted me open. That's See, I'm the landlord. And rent's due, you son of a bitch. Damn. See, he will buy that piss and company just to fire you again. AEW. The yeah. big dog let his bitches off the leash, so. Bro, I miss Randy Orton. Let's talk about your kid. I don't give a sh your kids. Ooh. I can't give you a shot at the WWE World Heavyweight Championship tonight. Even if I did, you'd probably choke in it anyway. Oh. I'm going to give you 10 seconds to come out here. Unless Booker T got real short and real fat real fast. Keep on talking. Hey, hey, hey do me a favor. Why don't you act like this is an AA meeting? Uh, I hate to add, y'all. How are y'all doing? I'm a, I see I got to get YouTube premium or some shit. A meeting and you sh Why don't you act like this is an AA meeting and you shut your mouth while I'm sharing with the crew. Oh, yeah, hold on. Hold on. Hey, y'all, look at this. Look at Randy. 
when he said that, Randy over here, hey, Randy be having the best reactions when people say some crazy shit, though. That'd be crazy. Just don't get all rated R like your boy Xavier Woods. Uh -huh. Well, it only takes one RKO to get to Viperville. No enhancement needed. And for those who don't know what he's talking about, that was when Brock Lesnar failed his drug test for UFC when he was about to have that match with Randy Orton at Survivor Series. You said you didn't suck. Who sucks now, you little bastard? <laughs> Why are you in Patterson like after this? After all, you're the one sleeping with him. Oh, Dean Ambrose? You yeah. need to watch your mouth, rich boy. From the very day that you were born, you've been your daddy's mm. When I heard that the most dominant player in NBA history was guest hosting Raw, I automatically assumed it was Kobe Bryant's. <laughs> this coming from a man who took a sacred vow of marriage to the biggest slut in the Western Hemisphere. <laughs> Don't worry, Wendy. Daddy's coming home tonight. That's cold. Made you a promise. Daddy was coming home. It looks like he's not, but I'll be your new daddy. Oh, well, he whooped his ass. Doesn't talk. Who are you, Brock Lesnar? Oh. Hey, hey. What? Are you still here? <laughs> yeah, I'm still here. Unlike your money in the bank contract. I think you deserve a shot at this. You don't deserve, <laughs> buddy. You will force me to strip you of the WWF Championship. When I get backstage, I am going to beat the living shit out of you. <laughs> you're a lot taller than Ray. Are you sure you're not Eddie's son? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I'll hold that championship high. Baby, when I do that, you can suck it. Damn. <laughs> I'm going to beat you down like the bitch you are. Woo! It's kind of like the Stanley Cup. They'll never see it in their lifetime. <laughs> kind of like you uh, winning a WWE championship. Yeah. Mm. The only reason you are WWE champion for a year is because Triple H didn't want to work Tuesday. <laughs> Maybe having a bottle of champagne around you isn't the best idea. Damn. Considering at the time, you probably weren't coherent enough to remember any of it anyways. The only television show you will ever be appearing on again is Total Divas. Ooh. Thousands of other women. You want to walk with Elias. I have to break it to you, Trish. I don't date women in their 60s. Oh. It's oh. okay. A lot happened in 2002. That's the last time you were relevant. The only Randy. door you ever knocked down was the door to John Cena's bedroom. Uh -huh. And he eventually threw you out of that exact same door. She was cold for that. Rhonda was cold for that, though, yo. <laughs> she definitely was cold for that. But, yeah, this video was good, as always. Apex Predator does his thing, though, with the, uh, with the countdown or whatever, you know, with the reactions and stuff like that. If you like me re uh, doing reactions to WWE videos just as well, definitely leave the comments down below and, you know, I'll check them out. You know, send me links and everything. And like I said before, any creators and stuff like that that have any advice for me as I'm still getting the kinks together on working this little channel here. You know, this is just not only going to be a reaction channel, but it's going to be, you know, vlogs and all types of other things that goes on. So anyway... If you like what you hear, see, whatever. I don't know why I said here. Like I'm on the telephone or something with y'all. <laughs> Fuck is that? <laughs> but uh, yeah, if you like what you uh seen, then you know what I'm saying? Send me some love and we go from there though. Great vibes and let's have a good one.